Hello, my name is Bud Alvary. I'm the business manager and financial secretary for Local 46 here in Seattle, Washington. We're down at the JTC today and we're interviewing some of the brothers and sisters on their past life on how they got into the IBW, what they like about the IBW and what it's done for them. How are you doing, Mark? I'm good, how are you? I'm doing good. Why don't you run back a little bit in your life and tell me how you started out and how you actually got into the Local 46. I was working non-union for 10 plus years in a local shop in Seattle, uh, just a small shop, did a lot of bars, breweries, and Ballard. My uh, journeyman I worked through joined about five years ago into the IBW, seeing the benefits and really encouraged me and my family, because I was a single dad, and to really think about my future in the long run. Because uh, once he started, he really realized the all the benefits. Since you've been in, talking about the benefits, how is the money and the health and welfare and the pension? How do you get along with that with you and the kids? Oh, that's incredible. I was paying you know, close to $300 a month just for medical because I had kids. So to know that I'm not uh, really helps financially as well. And I get braces for my daughter. All right. When you got into the IBW, how were you treated as far as with all the brothers and sisters coming in? Uh, incredible. Uh, there are a lot of misconceptions that I would have come in feeling like a stepbrother versus a true brother because I did not go from the beginning or start from the beginning. And I have not once felt that I was welcomed with open arms. Since, you, since you've actually been in the IBW for a while, uh, how's, the, how's the feeling with the people out there? Oh, you, after work hours, do you get to have you met a lot? Do you run around with them? Do you attend union meetings? Do you do any of the functions we put on? Yeah, I have. Uh, we uh planning a little get together with uh, the crew I'm on after work on Friday. We'll hang out a little bit and then go the separate ways. It's been great for me. So if you ran into any of the guys you used to work with, what would you tell them now about the IBW? I still encourage them. Yeah. I definitely encourage them that they got to think about their future as well. And do you have family in the IBW too? My father-in-law uh, just got his 45 year pin from local 48. Down in Portland, huh? Yep. All right. Do you, do you see him much? Do you guys? Uh, I go down to Oregon almost once or twice a month. All right. That's good to hear. <laughs> He's one of my best friends. In fact, well, that's really good to hear, Mark, and I've really enjoyed talking with you. I've learned some about you, and I hope that uh, maybe we'll see each other more at the Union Hall and maybe the meetings and get to know each other better. But thank you very much. Thank you. I appreciate it.